All right, nice job, everybody. Does anybody have any questions on the first technique? Okay. Um, so real quick, um, okay. Does everybody understand what I meant by uh, making your opponent be one, two, three steps behind? Yes. Just a little bit? Okay. Um, so that's the name of the game when I'm starting to pass, okay? What is the main goal? Why do I want to pass the guard? What's the mindset? Huh? Yeah. So what's, where's my goal? Where do I need to get to? So mount is the ultimate goal, right? So I gotta get to the mount, or I need to get to the chest there. Okay? It's gonna give me an opportunity to attack a little bit better and get a submission even better. Okay? Because the better position that I have, the more I'm gonna be able to attack and finish my opponent. Because the name of the damn game is who can submit each other first, right? Typically. Uh, if it's an attacker or whatever, then it's an easier way for me to neutralize my attacker. Okay. What are the concerns behind guard? What are some issues that I'm going to deal with? So if I'm in close guard, what's the first issue I got to deal with? So getting out. What else, Tom? Well, Rip. Tom? Rip. Yeah, I'm going to have to deal with rips. What else? Balance. Foster control, balance, right? So if you notice, there's a lot of stuff I gotta deal with. Big one is the leg. I'm gonna have to deal with the legs. Do not fight with the legs, guys. I know it's easy to kind of do that because the legs are there and you just like muscle through the leg. If anything, bring your weight forward and just start collapsing your weight on the legs. It's better. Okay? Because then it becomes you become heavier, you start to shift your weight a little bit. So if I get to a point where I'm like this, okay, and you move your legs a little bit. I start to fight with the legs, and I'm here all day long, I'm gonna get tired, okay? The leg is super strong, all right? If I wanna make the leg weaker for him too, you have to have the mentality to stand up. Do not break the guard from the bottom, okay? There's so much value for you standing up. You get better at balance, you get better at your base, you get better at your posture, the legs get heavier, you have gravity on your side, you have angles on your side, have to stand up. I know it sucks sometimes because <laughs> you don't want to stand up and you'd rather just do it from here. If you're going to do it from the bottom though, then you can start to kind of start. The only way you're going to be good at this from the bottom is you have to start to turn your hip a little bit. You can already feel a lot of pressure on the legs right now. See if I turn the knee Because I'm just turning a little bit at a different angle. I can push the leg. See? If I stay square to him, I'm going to be fine with the legs and I'm not going to get anywhere. Okay? In the closed guard, try to stand. Okay? Get some grips, grab the sleeve, winch a wiper, stand up. Okay? You might catch your leg on the other side, but guess what? That's how I get better. I don't stay square again, because if I stay here, he's going to sweep me. Look, there. See how I turn myself? Now I have an angle. Broke his legs, there's a lot of pressure on the hip bone right here, and I'm turning. That's how I get better at keeping my balance and structure. If you ask these guys to try to sweep me from here or from there, I'm like a rock. You're gonna sweep me and be solid on the ground. Okay? And then um, if I'm standing as well, I'm like this. One, two, I stand, maybe he grabs, I go second level of base. Okay? This is first level of base. This is not good because he can still grab me right here and he can control me and it's not putting a lot of pressure on the legs. This is different. Even if you have to like, hold on, sometimes you have to hold on. I can get used to like carrying him a little bit, or he's gonna he's gonna start to fall. There's too much gravity. Okay. Then I start to turn, pop. Then I start to go. And this is what I mean by dropping your weight. I don't want to fight with the legs, but I want to get heavy. Okay. Move your legs a little bit up. Yeah. Look, I'm just getting heavy, heavier, heavier. I'm not trying to be like try to throw the legs and push. Okay. But if you're new and you're learning, that could be the mentality, right? Because you're, that's all you really know. You don't know a lot of technique. You don't know angles, things like that. Okay? So the next, the next technique. Okay, he sits up. Okay? I'm gonna be square for a second. My mentality right now is I gotta get an angle. So look, right here. Okay? I'm 45 degrees parallel to him. Is he one step behind? Yeah, he's gonna get squared to me. He's gonna turn and he's gonna come back. Okay? 
Here. When you get square to me, I'm gonna hop to the other side. Foot on the ground, foot on the hip, this leg comes, push, the unbalance. Okay? <laughs> Roll. Angle. There. So he just gave you the angle to, for me to pass. Put your foot on the hip, guide the leg through, knee on valley, grab the collar, good control. Okay? How many points do I get total when I do that, Scott? Yeah, three points? More than that. Because I just did two positions. Does anybody know? Five. Okay? Three for the pass, two for the unbalance. Okay? So come here. Here. Yeah. Cool. So when I step, if I go this way to my right and I step to my left, it's got to be my right leg. I know it's kind of confusing, but if I go to my left, it's got to be my right leg. Follow through. So. Okay. If I go to my right side, my left leg steps over, plant the foot, push the shoulders, come across. So everything that I'm showing you right now is all fluid passing. There's no pressure, no being heavy, no weight distribution. That's a whole different mindset when you're passing guard. Right now it's a fluid motion. We're going to put everything together and they're going to be fast, going to be fluid. So you're going to pass open guard a little better. Okay? So same thing, one minute 30 on top, one minute 30 on bottom, or switch top to bottom, and then you guys can switch. Just make sure you get your angle. Boom. Then. Then. Okay? See? It's going to be a lot less than that. Yeah. <laughs> Any questions? All right, on three. One, two, three. Carter, one minute, 30 seconds. You guys got it? Yeah.